What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon X walkthrough. Okay, so we changed up the threads, went back to blue, put on some beige pants or brown pants or something, and red boots, and yes, we got ourselves a nice camouflaged, uh, what was it, cap? That way we can keep warm and all that stuff, because we're going to be going into the, in the, into the Frost Cavern now. Before we do anything, well, this place really isn't nothing. Next see, even when two pe Pokemon are the same species, it doesn't mean their strength are the same. For example, a Pokemon raised by a trainer will be stronger than one found in the wild, which is true. Um, yeah, this place it doesn't really offer a lot, except for, like, move changers and all that crud. Let's see. I'm gonna take a small tour, and then we're gonna go straight into the Frost Cavern, because we gotta take care of business right there. And, well, let's see. Uh, Pokemon are amazing to learn and forget moves immediately. Now, this is the move deleter right here. So if you do have a move that you don't want on a Pokemon, this is the man to go to. Go to this lady, and she is the Madam Reminder. And, well, she can remind a Pokemon of a move that it had before. Just bring her a hard scale, and then she'll help you out right there. Which I kind of don't want to do right now. Now, let's see. Uh, what else is there? There was a Pokeball item right here. I'm going to go get that. Look at that. Grab this. We found ourselves a big root. Don't know exactly what that does, but it's something right there. And, well, let's move on right here. There is a nice sight to see right here. Look at this. Uh, windmills rotate just like a wheel of destiny. Yeah, so rotation batters are like windmills. Uh, I mean destiny. I thought she was going to battle me and all that stuff. That would have been bad. Okay, so visiting houses, seeing what's up. Let's see. Hoo-ha, you have a Pokedex. How many of uh, the Pokemon you have found in the Mountain Kalos Pokedex? <laughs> you found 23? If you find 70 or more, I'll give you something of delight. Okay, which will I I'll probably do off-screen. So bad, so bad guys are all like, we will take over the world, but I think it will be really hard to, to look after everybody. It is true. How can you, how can you take over the world? I don't know. I really don't know. That's always been something, a question of mine. And look at this. Look at this. That is a nice, nice view right there. That is a very nice view for a thumbnail, too. <laughs> All right, let's see what happens right here. And, well, let's go ahead and talk to this person. One of the ways Pokemon trainers make their Pokemon strong is to use TMs. I know it's a bit sudden, but do you, uh, but do you tell me, do you have a TM for Poison Jab? Yes, I do. It's certainly a TM for Poison Jab. Are you making your Pokemon even stronger by using it? Yes! Gave it to Goku, and we're getting a Lepa Bear for that. Now, every day I believe she will actually want to see a TM that... whatever. Even when it's cold, I wear shorts, but that's not the facade. Okay, let's take this. We get ourselves facade. Yeah, buddy, we get ourselves facade, because it, it, it actually hurts. It actually hel helps the, the Pokemon. Even when their status is affected and all that crud. And, well, right here, let's see what we got right here. Uh, let's see. Um, if you talk to this guy, when things look alike, I try to, uh, to find differences between them. Then the things look different. I just try to find similarities. It's just a lot of fun. For example, how many uh, similarities do you find Tynamo and Motham share with each other? Do not know. And some people like big Pokemon, and some like them smaller. Size really comes down to personal preference. Wow. Wow. Says every woman out there. <laughs> no one will believe that I I saw a huge Gorgeist. A uh, Gorgeist? 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 I don't even know. Okay. So, let's go right ahead and... Well, not go right here. Let's go straight to Frost Cavern. Because there's something going on right there. We need to check out. We really do. Alright, so here we are at Frost Cavern, and you will be finding some Pokemon trainers who we want to battle. <laughs> it's so cold. You there. You came just right in time. Let's warm our bodies with the vigorous Pokemon battling. How in the hell are we going to warm our bodies in a Pokemon battle when the Pokemon are battling? I don't know. So here he comes out with a, uh, wow, he came, he came out with a Pokemon that is a weak against freaking Ice-type Pokemon, a Vibrava. Vibrava. And, well, I got a very good move for this guy. Let's go with the Smackdown. Lay the Smackdown on his candy ass. And not very effective. And here comes a Sandstorm. So now everything changes. And, well, look at that. We're getting hurt. So let's go right ahead and use a Surf Attack. Hopefully we win with this. Come on. Hopefully we win. 
Come on. Look at that. It's a good one. It's a good victory. Look at that. And we defeated Ross. Oh, yes. Okay. Now we're moving on right here. Now, as you can see, there is a there is a freaking ice storm going on, and it yeah, this place is normally not that hectic. Now we gotta find the spot right here to look at this guy. There we go. Care for a sky battle with the sky trainer? Yes, I will. Let's do this. Bring it. And this guy has two. And he's coming out with a car divine. I did not know the car divine is a. Well, it can fly. I didn't know that. Okay, so let's go right ahead and use that flamethrower. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Flamethrower does its trick. Carnivine is no more. Look at that. Okay, alrighty. And we're getting hit by... Yeah, we're getting hit by the storm. And here comes out a Swana. Now, this could be a problem. So let's mega evolve and take care of business with the fly attack right here. Yeah. Trying to defeat me now. That's right. Got blue flames and everything. Super Saiyan blue form. And here we go. Getting hit by ha by hail. So does Swana. But here we go. Fly attack for the win. Suck on those. Oh damn it! I was about to say suck on those lemon and, and what the hell? Is that scald? Nope. That wasn't scald at all. Alrighty. Let's do this. Let's finish this guy off with Dragon Rage. Oh yeah, Dragon Rage does it. Yeah, buddy. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, alrighty. <laughs> Still undefeated. Still undefeated in uh, Sky Battles. Yeah, buddy. Okay. Um, so something's going up over there. Is something wrong in the Frost Cavern, Mammoth Swine? Sweet, sweet. Look at that. Are you headed to the Frost Cavern Trainer? This mammoth swine here usually can't get enough of giving people rides on Route 17, but these days it seems to be too worried about something in the Frost Cavern to give it rides. Mammoth swine is a Pokemon that loves cold climates, so maybe it sends something, ami something amiss in the Frost Cavern. The hell? And you are? My name is Trevor. I'm researching a distribu uh, the distribution of Pokemon in the Kalos region of at Professor Setkamora's request. I see. So that's why you were walking in clear out of the Frost Cavern then. Mammoth Swine seems to concerned about something over there. So be careful. I will. Thank you. What are you, uh, what are you gonna do, Sensei? I'm, I'm going to prepare my for my expedition. Well, we need a hero. Of course, I am the hero. And I'm not battling you not right now. Yeah, I'm gonna battle you later on. Let's see. There's nothing right there. Okay. So here we go, going into the Frost Cavern. Look at this. Holy crud, it's a big, big mountain. And, well, unfortunately, we can't ride our bikes. We can't skate. We're just going to be, you know, doing our thing right here. Okay, so let's use Super Repels. And hopefully these bastards last for a very, 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 very long time. And, uh, well, let's see, is there an item? Yes, we found ourselves an Ice Heal, which, of course, will heal our Pokemon from Ice-type attacks. And, well, let's go ahead and... Oh, wow! Completely forgot about uh, Goku right here. <laughs> oh, jeez. Okay. Okay, so... Yeah, we're gonna switch out. We're gonna revive our Pokemon. Let's see, let's see. Let's go... Not a max revive. We're just gonna use a simple revive. Completely forgot. I think in our last episode, uh... We... Oh, no, it was this episode, I think. Oh, no, last episode, yeah. <laughs> Got a little too cocky against a fairy type Pokemon, so let's go right ahead and battle this uh, this beauty right here. Look at this. Look, stop moving around. Seriously, pay attention to me. I need attention. Hey there, you look pretty strong. I'd be missing out if I let let you go without a battle. You pretty much are. So here we go. Cordelia wants the battle, and she's coming out with a Dewblade. Look at this guy. It's a pretty strong Pokemon. It's probably a Pokemon I would have if I went straight for Kalos. So let's go with a flamethrower right here. Look at that. Flamethrower does its trick. Dewblade. Dewblade defeated. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And Gaia. Growing to level 49. Inching closer to level 50 club. Yeah. Alrighty. Okay. So let's move on right here. Look at that. We can skate through this. Skating through life. 
Easy peasy. And here we are getting attacked. Rain or snow into batter's nut. An ace trainer does not let anything get in his way. Hey, an, ace, an ace trainer is always elegant in whatever he does. That's what it means to be an ace. Oh, well, I'm not really that elegant. I'll tell you that right now. I'm not that elegant, so... Yeah, we're gonna have to find something like something of a, of a better name for me. And this guy coming with the Raichu. Mm -mm. Now, elegance, I believe, does it, I believe it means not cuss a lot. And uh, yeah, I do cuss a lot in my videos. So yeah, don't don't necessarily think that I'm an ace trainer at all. I really don't think so. So there we go, flamethrower. And the flamethrower does it. Raichu defeated. Oh yes. Everybody's getting experience points. They're all going to be, you know, powerful by the time we hit the seventh badge. And this guy's coming out with a Golduck. Let's go to Fluffolt. It's been a while, man. I haven't seen you in like an episode or two. <laughs> That's how you know I love my Pokemon, guys. Speaking of which, so, yeah, we've been doing daily episodes, guys. Daily episodes, and. You guys are enjoying it, and, you know, I'm reaping the benefits of it by, you know, the amount of subscribers that have come by. Uh, from the start of this whole pandemic to right now, as I'm recording September 15th, 2020, uh, I've gained about 1,000 subscribers. And this is freaking good because, you know, I, you know, at one point I gave up on this channel, and... <laughs> Well, I stuck it through, and I'm doing better now, thanks to you guys. So again, thank you guys for the help. Thank you guys for subscribing. Again, all these videos are going to be of quality for you guys. That way you guys can watch something during this whole pandemic. I get that some of you guys, probably in high school, middle school, and all that stuff, but you guys are doing online classes, which is a big drag. I've seen it. I've probably taught a few kids. <laughs> Probably taught a few kids online, so yeah, I get what you guys are going through. And again, this pandemic will end soon, hopefully. I don't know. We'll see. I just don't know. And well, we defeated this guy. Easy. Alrighty. So let's go ahead and go in straight into this layer right here. And hmm. I think that's some uh, that, that has a special something right there. So let's go to the first one right here and check this out. Okay, so let's see. We found ourselves a dire hit. Nice item that, you know, can actually boost up critical hits and all that crud. And nothing right there. Okay, so let's move out and take care of business on this side of, this, of things. Now, we are we are in very good pace for, you know, to finish up this whole walkthrough eventually. Um, let's see, right there. Look at that. Corner shot. Look at that. You couldn't do that before. Now you could. Uh... We are, in, like I said, we are in very good pace to finish up this walkthrough at at some point during this year. And I did ask you guys the question about what walkthrough do you guys want to want to see of, uh, afterwards. I did explain the issues that went on with. Uh, oh crap! I'm trying to figure this out. <laughs> I did explain to you guys the the issue that went on with Pokemon Sun and Moon as I was playing it privately. And like I said, I gave you guys the option. Many, many of you guys have voted for me to just skip the Alola region and go straight to Sun, uh, Sword and Shield, which, you know, I, I'm probably going to do because, uh, well, you know, I, I, I see no way in, uh, I see no way in, uh, actually, what was it, in recording Sun and Moon, especially with what I have, and I am not going to spend about... 500 to a thousand dollars on another another wired capture card that way you know I can get this block done eventually it will be done somehow but I am probably not going god dang it fainted. yeah I'm probably not going to uh, I'm probably not going to to, to buy another uh, another capture card so that's probably the plans for right after this in fact I may or may not be taking a break from you know the regular walkthroughs um, once, once I'm done with uh, X Walker and go straight for the legendary Pokemon that I have yet to capture in other versions, just to complete them all. And that, just to give me a little bit more time to actually, you know, finish up, uh, you know, learning Pokemon Sun and Moon. Believe it or not, guys, or Sword and Shield, I should say. Uh, yeah, I haven't, I have yet to play that game. 
Even though I have a Switch now, I have yet to play the game because... Yeah... Why haven't I played it? I don't know. I really don't know. But eventually it will happen. It will, guys. Trust me. I'm trying to do the best. I'm trying to be the best. Like no one ever was. And look at that. Rhydon has been defeated. Oh, yes. Look at that. Okay. So we defeated Delman. That's right. You're not you're you're not in your neck of the woods right here. And now we got to revive our Pokémon yet again because we got a little we got a little sidetrack. Uh, so plans plans after I'm done with this walkthrough. Like I said, probably gonna take a break, a small break. Record other walkthroughs that are not you know linear to the adventure right here. And well, let's see. Ah, we got a karate. God dang. E either way we go, we're going to be taking on a karate person. Okay. So, like, yeah. Not linear to that. Capture Pokemon. Hell, we might even do a, uh, what was it called? A, uh, what was it? A, a Pokemon Elite 4 challenge in Pokemon Omega Ruby. I'm going to probably be using all of my, uh, all of my teams that I've used so far into the game. That way, you know, eventually, bam. They all win something. I will be trading, I will be completing walkthroughs, I will be completing uh, Pokédexes and all that stuff. In fact, somebody had mentioned on my last episode of my Pokémon, uh, what was it called? Uh, my Pokémon Yellow Walkthrough, that I have yet to complete the game because I have not battled Professor Oak, and I haven't defeated, uh, or I haven't uh, completed the Pokédex. Which, you know, it's very easy in Pokémon Yellow now that you think about it, because all you need all you really need is just one Pokemon game of the other type, like Pokemon Red or Blue, and bam, god dang it, you can actually complete the, 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 the walkthrough just like that. So that's probably what I'm going to be doing, and hell, I might even do it live, I don't know. Good god, Charizard has just fainted twice. Okay, so let's just destroy this guy right here. It's probably my fault because, you know, I use Surf right here. Look at that, Bonesaw gets hurt, but this guy takes the hit. Jeez. Okay, look at that. And Goku grows to level 48. Gaia grows to level 50, and everybody has been defeated. There's a guy named Wolf in here? That's pretty awesome. Alright, so again, reviving our Pokemon. Look at that. Now, I did forget to mention that I have been working on my Pokemon Snap reboot. Um, I know I played it like four times already, but in this game right here... And uh, in this game right here, I am uh, actually putting in on some backgrounds. That way that you guys can actually see what Pokemon will appear in, in Pokemon Snap. Hasn't been done. I haven't done this since like when I was Draven XC 7-Eleven. But it will be done right here. And that is all in preparation to the eventual Pokemon Snap on the Switch. Pokemon Snap Game 2 or something like that. Hopefully they do come out with it pretty soon here. Because as soon as it comes out, bam, I am playing it. I am going to feature it right here. kind of feel like I'm up to date with all the, the members here. And good God! Yeah. Bad luck to everything right here. Good God. Okay, here we go. Should have defeated this Scraggy. And he missed. Wow. So, yeah. Okay, alrighty. So, here comes a throw. Bring out that throw. That Pokemon right there. And here we go. Fly attack. Vengeance is not mine yet, and good god! Uh, jeez. Oh man, nearly faints right there. Okay, let's finish this guy off right here with the flamethrower. Ah, uh, yes. Flamethrower for the win! Suck it. Alrighty, okay, alrighty. And Kakashi grows to level 52. And it's learning double team. I'm not going to teach it right now. Although it's a very beneficial move for this Pokemon, and well. And that's that right there. I'm gonna try and heal up my Pokemon yet again. Oh, jeez. This is not the place for uh, Charizard right now. Mm-mm. Mm-mm-mm. All right. Well, let's see. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so we slide right here, and we're gonna be battling another trainer. Yahoo! I finally meet eyes with someone else in this freezing cave. You did. That's right. Got them blue eyes. Not really. <laughs> Okay, now off screen too, like I said guys, I was actually capturing Pokemon uh, in the areas that, you know, I have yet to capture Pokemon. I, and it's quite a few areas guys, I've been slacking on that. 
One to cover my Pokedex, and two to actually send over to the Switch. This guy survives. Good gravy. And eventually I'm going to be trying to evolve them all. Just so I can actually have some Pokemon in my Pokedex. Because, believe it or not, the comment that was made uh, on Pokemon Yellow that I haven't completed the Pokedex, it kind of got to me a little just because, hey, you know, in every walkthrough that I've done, I haven't completed some of the Pokedex. Maybe it's time to complete the Pokedex. I could probably do that, but, eh, well, we'll see. But right here, it's a little simpler because, uh, what? You'll be able to see every single Pokemon from Kalos. There's only, like,. I think when this game came out, there was probably like maybe 50 new additions, I think. 50 new Pokemon, that was it. That was probably the smallest amount of uh, Pokemon additions made in the in the history of this game, so... Yeah, that's something that you guys should keep an eye out for. And look at that. We won again. Okay. Alrighty, so let's see. Uh, we could swim right here and see what we, what we got right now. And, well, let's see. There is, an, there is a hidden area right here, and this kind of, uh, this kind of pooped me a little bit, because I did not know that you can actually, oh, hold on, just a sec. Oh, wait, probably should have said yes to that one. Good God. Pay attention, good old Draven. Pay attention. Alrighty. Alrighty, so let's see. Right here, you can actually evolve your Eevee once you make a touch right here, and you can grab this secret item, which is an icy rock. Which, you know, will prolong the whole uh, hailstorm ability. And then, uh, well, let's see. We're just going to continue on. And, of course, it is a little lagginess. The lagginess in here. I'm just playing. I'm not going to say to excuse the lagginess, because I'm in an area where you can actually record this whole thing. And, well, let's see. Eh, sliding. Come on. Where are you? Slide. Slide. Okay, there is a Pokeball right there that we can actually get, hopefully. And bam. Found ourselves a Max Repel. A good item, just for an extra 50 steps. Don't know why you don't know why you would not put like put it to 300 steps. And let's go ahead and surf right here. This has been cut off with those stones and this area. Oh, look at that! You'll find an item right here. You'll find a Never Melt Ice. Very beneficial for Ice Eye Pokemon right there, and well, let's go right ahead and uh, move on back right here. Alrighty, look at that, we're swimming, we're doing our thing, and I'm trying to get on this slide right here. Okay, right here, and here we go downstairs, and oh, the hell? Oh yeah, this is the entrance I think. Alright, so we got ourselves a Hyper Potion right here, nice item. And this lady, let's make a Bevoke so we can rest and restore our Pokemon. A Bevoke? What the hell does that say? What the hell? Okay, I don't even know what that word is. But we're going to be mo moving on. And this guy is going to look at us. He's like, oh no, I, can I can't feel my toes. Probably got Frostbite, guy. Probably got Frostbite. You don't want that. You really don't. And, well, he will be coming out with his Graveler. Again, a lot of type disadvantages for Godzilla right here. Oh god, okay. Let's go bulldoze attack. Oh uh, yeah. And look at that. His speed lowers and of course he's gonna be coming out with the smackdown right here. Alright, time to finish this guy off. Let's go. One more bulldoze for the win. Look at that. Yeah, Graveler had no chance. Okay, alrighty. And well, let's see. Coming out with a carbink. I'm going to continue oh crap. I know what a Carbink is. I thought it was a Steel type Pokemon. Never mind. And technically, we're on the ground, so we do not want to get an Earth uh, Ground type attack. And here we go, Kakashi. What's up? Oh damn! What the? What did it do? It, oh wow! It shared its guard. Okay, so eh, jokes on you, buddy. Don't have much of a guard right here. Look at that. Water type move does its trick. Carbink defeated. Kakashi gaining points. And he's coming out with another Graveler, so let's continue with Kakashi attack over right here. Let's go. Get it. Surf attack. Surf and turf. Does its thing. Look at that. And wow, it has its sturdy technique. Which, well, yeah. Cover it for one move. And that right there lowers our speed, but guess what? We still got a surf attack just to beat you. Look at that. 
Oh, yeah. Okay, alrighty. No more, or no, wait, no more, uh, whatchamacallit, and Bonesaw grows a little 45. Getting closer to evolution. Alrighty. I was about to say, don't tell me it's gonna evolve right now, damn, I wasn't ready. Okay, so, let's see. Um, there is an item right here somewhere, yes, a super potion. Okay, alrighty. And, well, let's go ahead and heal up our Pokemon yet again, because, uh, yeah. Godzilla, not having the best of luck here in the Frost Cavern. And, well, here we are. Now, this area right here will actually have an extra layer to it, so what I'm going to try and do first is I'm actually going to try and get to that layer. And we're going to get attacked by this guy. Good God. Okay, alrighty. Bunch of hikers in here. Yes, we are challenged by Hacker Brent, and yo, damn, he is coming out with a Proba Pass. Now, this Pokemon right here is a little more difficult to take down. I think it is a Steel type Pokemon, so let's see if uh, Flamethrower does its trick. Eh, well, it did something. It did something. It took the majority of its HP, so. Continue with it, maybe? I don't know. So let's go right ahead and go with a little bit of a Flamethrower right here. Look at that. Flamethrower does its trick. Proba Pass defeated. Tank of a Pokemon right there. Tank. Oh my god. Okay. Alrighty. So, let's see. Hmm. Now, we could... Eh, you know what? Let's battle this guy right now. Because eventually our adventure ends right towards that area. And he's like, the secret to karate is the have a good circular moment. Good circular moment, okay. Let's go. Going up against Kenji. And, yeah, he's coming out with his girder right here. Look at that. Got a big old girder. Alrighty. Let's do this. Let's go with a fly attack. Godzilla, let's go. And the rock slide almost takes us down, so hopefully this takes him out. Nearly does it, and here comes that rock slide. The rock slide, and he's flexing while he's doing it. Good God, okay. Look at that. Not having the best best kind of uh, luck against everybody here, so look at that. Flavor does its thing. Oh my God, Grr has been defeated. And look at that. Goku, level 49. Gaia, level 51. And we do our thing. Look at that. Okay. Alrighty. Alrighty. So, let's go ahead and use another Hyper Potion. Jesus Christ. Godzilla. Getting your ass kicked. Eh, it builds character, it does. Okay, so let's see. Go down here, and we can slide this way now. Now, in previous games, you couldn't even do that. You can only go left, right, up, down. But now you can go sideways and... Which is really good because it actually helps out. I learned this while I was trying to figure out how to get through this uh, the secret area right here. And, well, let's see. Hmm. Let's see. Ah, right here. Actually, wrong. Wrong way. Damn it! Okay. I'll figure it out. I will figure it out. There we go. Damn it. Okay. So I kind of screwed up right there. And... Damn it. Okay, there we go. Okay, probably should have gone all circular right there. Look at that. Okay, so let's... Almost did it. Okay, so I have to get down the middle, and I'm, like, really trying here, guys. Oh, damn it! Okay. It probably wouldn't have helped. Uh, let's see, let's see. Ah, oh, damn it. Okay, so, again... So, it finally... Ah, oh, damn it! It... Damn it, I think I knew what I did wrong. God dang it. Okay. There we go. Okay. Yes, put on another, another repel. So what we gotta do is right here. Here. Oh, Jeebus. Um. Oh! Well, that's some bullshit. Here we go. Look at that. Well, that was simple. Never mind. Okay, so after a nice amount of time trying it, we are now here. And there's another trainer waiting for us. Good God. I probably shouldn't praise my pupil so openly, but her Pokemon have gotten stronger. I'm very proud. Yeah, well, you know, try coaching. Try coaching, it's the same thing. You don't want to fill their ego up. Trust me on that one, guys. Okay, so here we go. Godzilla versus Medicham, and Medicham is about to get this whole fly attack right here. Alrighty. 
Let's get this fly attack. Let's go, and what you doing right here? Let's get this. Fly attack does it for the win. Meta Jam had no chance. And look at that. We get ourselves to level 54. Alrighty, okay. So we defeated Gabrielle right here, and well, time to get to that secret room. Hmm. Alrighty, so let's see. Mm, there could be a secret item right here now. Alright. Let's see. What are we doing? And actually, hold on. Let's go down. Okay, so there's a secret stairs. Let's go right here. We find ourselves a zinc. Very nice item. And well, let's go right ahead and go downstairs right here. And here is the secret area where I actually found out that you can actually go sideways when you skate right here, guys. And well, let's see. This is, you know, all confusing and all that stuff. But I'm trying to freaking, uh, let's see. There we go. Downstairs. Look at that. That's how you do it. And, yeah, it, it's actually very, very beneficial right there. So, there we go. We got ourselves TM79 Frost Breath. A very beneficial move. And, well, now it is time to finally figure out what the hell is causing this whole, you know, uh, hailstorm or ice storm or whatever, you know, they call it in the Pokemon world. And, well, look at that. We're sliding through life all easy and good god there we go look at that oh yeah okay so i'm here baby let's see what's going on right here and would you look at that team flare is up to no good again it's really cold in here isn't it sensei is there something going up ahead yeah ah oh, crud this obama snow is a fine specimen it's absolutely brimming it with the energy the more it, 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 the, the more we agitate it, the stronger its snow warning ability becomes, be making the snow fall even more fero fer ferociously. Let's catch it swiftly and get out of here. Snow. Oh damn! You gotta save that Pokemon. Hey! Oh damn! Calm down, man. Hey! You Pokemon thieves! What are you doing here? Oh damn! What does it look like? We're catching Pokemon. Why else would we grab all of those Pokeballs? It was all so it was all so we could catch powerful Pokemon like a bomb snow. It's full of potent energy. Energy? You're not the brightest one, are you? Whoever has the most Pokemon in the most energy will uh, come out on top. Lazy people who just wait for things to be handed down to them don't even get the don't even get these resources. But why is Team uh, Flare amassing Pokemon energy and money? To put it to to put it another way, why is Team Flare always trying to make everything for itself? Allow me to spell it out uh, for you. It's so that it's so Team Flare and only Team Flare can survive. After all, why should we care about saving people who aren't on our side? Anyway, I don't mind a healthy curiosity, but I'm afraid I just don't have any more time for you. Huh? Sensei, did they say only Team Flare will survive? These people have a few screw looses, or loose screws, or whatever. You two, hurry up and send these kids packing. Oh damn. Yes ma'am. Right away. Let's go Team Flare. This is the trademark pose of Team Flare. It's a very definition of fashionable. Oh damn. Okay, so here we go. Another battle. Double battle. Or no wait. Not double. Okay, come on. Should have double battled against these guys. But oh well. We can take care of business by ourselves because, you know, our partner is not that great at Pokemon battling. And look at that. Flamethrower does its trick. See, that's how you do it. How long is it going to take you to defeat their, uh, her Pokemon? And here she comes out with a main neck trick. So let's go right ahead and go to Bonesaw right here. That's right. Bonesaw is close to evolving. We want to evolve it. Look at his Bonesaw. Looking all mean and m m majestic and all that stuff. So here we go. Get this Dragon Claw and uh, crud. Not so, not so good after all. The Rocky Helmet does help us. So here we go. Dragon Claw nearly does it. And let's go again. Ah, uh, crud. Another bite attack right there. But guess what? Rocky Helmet does the trick. Say goodbye to Magnetric right there. Boats off gains levels. And Team Flare Grunt has been defeated. Hmm. Do you think I can reverse the time and point at a loss? No, you can't. Draven received 1,680 Poke Dollars. That's right. We're getting richer by the minute. 
I may have lost. I may have lost, but isn't Winter Wonderland beautiful? Almost as beautiful as the red flare pose. Oh, damn. Okay. Time to take care of business. Hmm. You're more powerful than you look. I wonder how much energy there is inside of you. Trust me, there's a lot of energy. Giggity, giggity, goo. Here we go! Team Flare, Mabel wants the battle. And she is coming out with her very own Hound Dower, or Hound Doom, I should say. Alright, let's do this. Maximum effort. Let's go. Bulldozer attack. Time to bulldozer, or time to bulldoze this person right here. You guys don't get the reference. Too young. And here we go. Foul play. Does its trick. Almost takes us. Well, it takes a lot, but here we go again with another bulldoze attack. Say goodbye to Hell Doom. Or Hera. You guys remember Hera from Pokemon Platinum? Yeah, I remember. And Kakashi hit Jacket. Grows to level 53. Flood Volt to level 45. And Mabel has been defeated. Why don't you take off those glasses? Not just strong, too strong! Not ordinary indeed! That's right. I'm doing the pose. Okay. Hm. I have no patience for losing. Let's get out of here. Hm. Okay, alrighty. And, well, doesn't battling with Team Flare scare you, Sensei? I'll admit it scares me. I don't like battling them. But we managed to protect Obama Snow by pitching in here. I know I'm a reserve type, and I'm okay with that, but it's important to be bold and necessary. Mamoswine doesn't have to worry about Obama Snow in, uh, about, or Mamoswine doesn't have to have to worry about Obama Snow anymore, and that's what matters. All well that ends well. Okay, alrighty. Hmm. Now, if you take a look at this Obama Snow, he's gonna be like Snow. What's this? It looks like Obama Snow wants to give you something. And bam. Throwing out that piece, and we got the Bumasite, which is a Mega Evolution Stone for a Bum Snow. Very good. Okay, so we've accomplished our mission right here, guys. Man, nearly 40 minutes of adventure right here. This is pretty awesome. Oh my god, we have completed a lot in a short amount of time. Guys, I am very, very excited for the rest of this whole walkthrough right here because, Jesus, man, how much time do we have? And. No, I do not need a, another reflect in or another repel. And as you can see, guys, no more snow. Mama Snow has a you know calm down and everything. So in our next adventure, we're going to be going out of. Uh, well, we're going to be getting into the next town. We've already defeated everybody right here. I know there's a Pokeball there, but we can't get that until we get uh, Waterfall. And you know what? Let's do one last thing. Let's go down this bar right here. Look at this, grinding it out. Let's let's blade. Bam! I'm back, baby. So, yeah, in our next adventure, we're going to be going straight to Route, I think, 17. That's what it was called. And, yeah, we're going to be taking care of business right there, too. So, thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys next time.